What's going on, people? It's Double Cody here. Welcome back to another video. Let's see, we're here with more Marvel's Ultimate Alliance. And oh, I got strong. Okay, strong, strong. Let's see away from him. Shot him out, apparently. Next time, I want to find somebody who doesn't smell like old cheese. Take your shield. Take your shield. Take your shield. Take your I just got him. Another drone. Okay. Oh! That was a helicopter. Not going that way. Up here. Hi, Spider-Man, the thing, Marvel, Wolverine, Ooh, that's our names. How that's me too, I'm sure. Okay, I have to get up here. I remember how to do this one too. I did it somewhat recently. Okay. How's she moving like that? Outside or inside? That's inside. That's the soldiers. Shadow, right there. Looks like it. Target in range. Ow! Don't shoot me. They're advancing. Next time, I want to fight somebody who doesn't smell like old cheese. Okay. Shield. Shields are annoying. Team get it, sir. Nice, okay. Put my farm a little bit. Go outside again. Oh, there's a helicopter, or a helicopter. It's landing. That might make it easier to shoot down at least. Right? Man, I can't wait for Spider-Man the Adventures game. It's not coming for a while, I don't think. Next character coming out is Hawkeye, then Black Panther, then potentially She-Hulk, then uh, the Bucky, the Chill Journey, then Peter Parker. Alright, I'm thinking of the list that has their names of Bucky and Peter Parker instead of the Chill and Spider-Man. So uh, that's what I'm calling that. Oh, sure there isn't. Boy, am I glad to see you guys. I've been trying to unlock the door to the bridge, but a helicopter keeps strafing the deck. Can you give me a hand? Sure. Use the anti air Oh, anti air crap gun. Take out anything that threatens you. Sounds like a plan. All I ask is that you take the helicopter out quick. I don't think I'm going to last long out in the open. Don't worry. We'll protect you. Hello? 
let's jump down here. Yeah. <laughs> she used a gun. Nice. Got it. The door to the bridge is open. Thanks for the assist. I would have been Swiss cheese if you hadn't taken that helicopter out. Watch to stay here. We'll check out the bridge. There's no tell what trap A might have waiting in there. You get no argument from me. I've had enough excitement for one day. Okay. Lost the shield, what are you gonna do now? Target. Ooh, Logan's got my guy, jeez. Okay. Let's continue on. Shall we? Over here. Why is Aim here? I guess that's the work with Bob. All right. Ooh, how embarrassing for you. Okay. Oh, oh that's down. Ow! No, it's not. Never mind. Look, look, one second. I'm down. Mode up. What's this? We're frozen in place. Mura, says free. From make way slim to a dam, thousand innocent lives be lost, including your life. <laughs> your pleas amuse me. I tell you, let's have a contest. But instead of brawl, how about a test of brave? No time for this insanity. I'm afraid you have no other option. Now, if you think you'll receive an electrical shock for every incorrect answer you give. Okay. Let's begin, shall we? What force holds you to the earth? Gravity. That was a lucky guess. Who found Poison Mobile as Who is Loki, the true son of? Luffy. No! Could you have known that? Oh, Marvel fan. Which Good type thing. of master are atoms most tightly packed? Solid. Somehow you're cheating. We have to all we have to question correctly. We're free. The deal is over. Trick me somehow. Ah, you. Did you have a for mode out? Nice. Ow. Yeah, like that. Oh my god! Ow, guys! You guys take me out one guy? Down the mega base, left, uh, the mega base. Let's go. Got that first. Oh, this. In first, pick up more of Tim. You did it. You stopped the Omega base. No problem, Dugan. But huge mobile lab toys out that are. Uh, we, we stopped huge mobile lab toys that destroy the dams all the time. I messed up that line. Guys, that was one for the books. There's no time to 
time to relax. Colonel Fury wants you back at Stark Tower immediately. Stay where you are, and I'll pick you up in the Quinch. Okay, cool. Might be a shorter episode, uh, You did a good job know. on the Omega Base team. You saved thousands of lives and billions of dollars in shield equipment. I don't want to start something and not be able to finish it later on. Master View, did Master View steal anything? Or, uh, 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 did Masters of Evil steal anything other than the Super Soldier Serum? Yes, a device known as the Mutant Amplifier. It magnifies a mutant's natural powers. So what's our next move? Until we locate Doom's base, nothing. And since all we're doing is cooling our heels, I want you to investigate a report that there's a riot taking place in Atlantis. Ooh, Atlantis. See Wyatt Wingfoot, and he'll take you to Shields Atlantis Outpost. Or if you'd like more information, talk to the Black Widow. Okay. Let's talk to Black Widow. We just received a message from Nemorita, the cousin of Nemo. Apparently, there is a riot going on in Atlantis. What's the cause? They may use the Fantastic Four because they're friends of Nemo. What's the cause of this? Unknown. The cause. But for some reason, the Atlanteans well, have Captain forcibly America removed Namor from his throne. But the Atlanteans love Namor. Yes, which means something is seriously wrong. See Wyatt when you are ready to go to Shield's outpost in Atlantis. Why would the Atlanteans attack Namor? We do not know. He has been a fair and just ruler for many years. The people love him. He's pretty hard strong. Maybe he finally went too far. Perhaps. But Namor has always been kind to his people. There has to be some other explanation for this mass hysteria. Are the Atlanteans friendly? When Mer people and surface dwellers first met, there was quite a bit of hostility. There were even several invasion attempts. We're allies now, aren't we? The relationship between our two races is lukewarm at best. The Mer people prefer to keep us at arm's distance. How is how is your Atlantis? Once you reach our Atlantis outposts. You will be infected with a special nanotechnology. Mr. Fantastic and Dr. Pym had a hand in developing it. What's this technology do? It will allow you to breathe water with no discomfort. You will also be able to move along the bottom of the ocean as if you were moving on dry land. Ooh, that's nice. This needs uh, the description of My apology. Thanks for the information, Black Widow. You are quite welcome. What else can we talk to? Use Iron Man's lab. Let's do that after we talk to anyone else here. Vision's right there. We're to him. We're to him about anything else, though. Welcome, my friend. Uh, who's Namor? Namor is the first known hybrid of Homo sapiens and Homo mermanus, humans and mer people. He can breathe water and air, but if he's away from water too long, he will begin to weaken. How do you feel about humans? As with most mer people, he has an inborn distrust of surface dwellers. And true to his belligerent nature, Namor can take his distrust to the extreme. Who are the Atlanteans? The Atlanteans are distant cousins to your race. Having evolved on the ocean floor, it is impossible for them to breathe air. What other ways do humans mer people differ? Because they live in the extreme conditions of the ocean, mer people are very hardy. They are stronger than humans, can swim up to 30 miles per hour, and live to be over 150 years of age. Nice. I am glad to be a... Division. Wait, who? Don't know. Who? What are these? A small thermonuclear device is missing. That's not good. Star Tower is dangerous. Uh, oh, it was wide out to say. Oh, we can go to him for the mission. Never mind. I'm not ready for that. We're gonna end the video off today. Doing something else. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna talk to him here. Oh, who's this the grab? So, yeah, Iron Man's lab, though. So I believe there's a character back there that a friend of mine has like wanted to see. Yep, he's alive. Pretty cool. Ooh, Moon Knight. So apparently Oscar Isaac has been confirmed to play him. There he is, Edwin Jarvis. 
Welcome Not an AI, and good but day to you. I am Edward butler. Jarvis, personal butler to Mr. Anthony Stark. He's basically Marvel's Jarv or Alf Alfred, but uh, he's Tony Stark's butler and the Avengers butler too. This area is where Mr. Stark carries out the research and development of his Iron Man suit. As you can imagine, the body armor has become so complex that a staff of technicians is required. You may walk around and inspect the facilities. I believe you'll already find several of your compatriots here. Okay. There's Electra, Black Panther up there, I think? Who are you and how'd you get in here? Uh, yeah. Uh, the name's Jack Hammer. Uh, but you can call me Weasel. Everyone does. Yeah, and don't worry. I came in through the back. No one saw me. What do you want? Uh, Wyatt Wingfoot gave me a damaged laptop. Said you heroes wanted to know what data was on it. You find anything out? Yeah, that laptop holds security information for a building called the Imperium. What's the Imperium? I can find out, but you'll have to get me the password into Shield's priority files. Oh, there's uh, there's three possibilities: Jacob Fury, Baron Struker, or Gabriel Jones. Talk to Vision; he'll be able to help. Huh. Okay. So here's Jarvis, Weasel. This is some Iron suits. This is cool. Here's the ultimate Iron Man suit. That was, I, I'm not a huge fan, but I don't hate it. Here's Black Panther. I must admit, I find news of a shield outpost near Atlantis very intriguing. What's so interesting about the shield outpost? Now I know the extent Shield is willing to go to to gather information on countries with closed borders. Doesn't your country will kind of have closed borders? Indeed, it does. And now I wonder if perhaps Shield doesn't have an outpost hidden there. Hmm. Why does we kind of have closed borders? We have the largest deposit of vibranium in the world. To open our borders would be an Seems invitation to those who would conquer us. People have invaded Wakanda? Over the centuries, fools have tried. But the Black Panther is always there to stop them. Are you concerned about Dr. Doom? Indeed I am. Victor Von Doom has created a sizable army of super villains. Uh, Tony Stark up there? What do you think he's up to? I don't know. But Doom must have a truly grand scheme to risk attacks on the Helicarrier and the Omega base. You are quite after. welcome. There's Cap. Yeah, Tony Stark. Stark Tower's a beauty, isn't she? I consider her one of my greatest achievements. If we let us Stark Tower's headquarters. No problem. Our little task force needed a base, so it seemed like the thing to do. The tower must have cost a fortune to build. I wasn't worried about the cost. That is, until S.H.I.E.L.D. and I had our little disagreement. You got told with S.H.I.E.L.D.? More like they had trouble with me. I wanted out of the weapons business. I can't tell you how many breach of contract suits they filed. They sued you? That was just the beginning. Suddenly I had trouble getting building permits, filing patents. Uh, don't get me started on how my taxes changed. What? what uh, why'd you want to get out of the weapons development? I'm not sure exactly. One morning I realized I needed to do more than just amass wealth. I wanted to help people, and weapons aren't that helpful. Weapons develop, uh, well, weapons development was uh, earning billions. You really don't need that many billions to get by. No, my life's taking a new course. I want to be remembered for helping lives, not destroying them. Okay. That's Anytime, time, my friend. Anytime at all. Let's talk to Cap. I know seeing the Super Soldier Project has raised some concerns about S.H.I.E.L.D., but let's get all the facts before we cause any trouble. I think S.H.I.E.L.D. is a reputable, or a reputable organization. I think S.H.I.E.L.D. has a lot to deal with, and sometimes it makes mistakes. But historically, it's done a great job of keeping the peace. Hmm. Okay. Didn't you see how they're turning volunteers and monsters on, on the main base? I saw they were testing out a new version of the Super Soldier Serum. The same type of drug that gave me my strength and agility. You took the Super Soldier Serum? Yes. During World War II, I volunteered for Operation Rebirth. It was a program for creating physically superior soldiers. 
What happened? I exceeded their expectations. Unfortunately, Dr. Erskine, the man who developed the drugs, was killed, and no one's been able to recreate his work. Do you think Black was up something? I have to admit, things sound kind of suspicious. Like, why was she carrying that laptop during the attack on the helicarrier? So you think she's a spy? No. A spy I'd need a lot more evidence before I'd say something like that about the Black Widow. Thanks, Captain Anytime. America. And a lecture. The Black Widow is up to something, I just know it. Did you see how nervous she was on the helicarrier? Is Black Widow working for the Sure looks like it. She must have been trying to get that laptop to the enemy during the helicarrier battle. So you think the enemy wants information on the Imperium? Yes. That laptop shows all security systems for the building. And from the looks of those systems, the Imperium must hold something valuable. Hmm. You're talking about fear about Black Widow. Not yet. She's his second in command. We're going to need some pretty strong evidence to shake Fury's faith in her. You really think he'd need more evidence? Yes. Colonel Fury's trust doesn't come easily. And once given, it's nearly impossible to break. Oh. Could emotions be clouding judgment towards Black Widow? Okay. So Daredevil and I were close several years back. And the Black Widow and Daredevil were close not so long ago. So maybe you're jealous of her. No, I'm not. I'm long over Daredevil. If he can find happiness with the Black Widow, I wish them both the best. Okay. Thanks, Lotra. You're welcome. Okay, so that's gonna be it for this video, guys. As usual, if you like this video, please leave a like. If you want more of this content, please subscribe and share with friends. We greatly appreciate it. This is Joe Coda, signing off.